All right, hey guys, DJ Steph here, Uptown Express Productions. So today I'm gonna to do a very quick review on uh, a CD backup that I just uh, purchased to replace what I've been using for many, many years as my backup um, in my rack that you see behind me. Um, and also a little bit of a topic on what you use for backups and how important backups are. So um, what I use for my backup uh, that I have been using for, for over 15 years now was um, a Newmark CDN 34. Um, that was actually my first uh, my first real sort of DJ gear that I bought after I had a mixer and my turntables. Um, it was one of their, if not the first, dual CD player that came out with uh, pitch control and uh, um, anti-shock memory and, and all that stuff. I've had that uh, thing in my case behind me um, for all these years as my backup system always hooked up ready to go with the cd inside um uh, two cds in fact with the song queued up at every single event um now that new mark which i'll show you in a second um i've now disconnected it um was very big very bulky i think it was around 35 pounds or so it was two pieces the bottom part the actual drives were two u a two u space and the actual controller on top with all the buttons was another two u so you needed four u um in total, uh, two on the bottom and two on the top. I saw this new thing from Gemini called the CDMP-1400. It's a 1U uh, CD player with USB um, input as well. So it's a USB player and CD player all in one in a one space uh, rack mountable fixture or you know device, which is amazing. And it's very, very well priced. Um, up here in Canada, it was going for about $289 or so, $300 was that. Um, it was actually very difficult to find in Montreal. Uh, no one had it in stock and it was back ordered for who knows how long. Um, so I actually ended up buying it on eBay. You can find quite a few on eBay, um, but I, they do seem to be sort of hard to, to come by. Um, anyway, found it on eBay, had it shipped here. Um, I'll show you the box in just a second. But this device, I just plugged it in and um, it works great. I, it loads up the CD. It's a little bit loud and takes a takes a, probably a good five, six seconds to read the CD. But, you know, it's a backup. Um, I plugged in a USB drive. Uh, I think I have an eight gig drive in there. Put a couple of folders. You can go in there, select your folders, select the song. It loads it right up. I mean, really great. The information scrolls on the screen. Um, fantastic. You cannot play the two things at the same time so you cannot play a USB and browse the CD or you cannot play a CD and browse the USB you can only browse the current device that you're on so you can be playing off the USB key and browse through the songs that are on the USB key and then you kind of just load it up and it'll uh, you either stop the song and it'll load up the, the next one so I mean really great um, on top of that, having another backup, so I find it very important to have a CD backup because if anything should go wrong with the computers or anything like that, you have the CD ready to go. On top of that, my backup to the backup is an iPhone or an MP3 player. I always keep uh, a good couple of hundred songs on their current stuff uh, and a variety of things too, slow, fast dances, um, mixes also, some, some mega mixes um, that you have ready with a, a little mini jack, you know, have a get an RCA adapter to the mini jack for the uh, headphone output on the iPhone or any MP3 player, and that's your backup to the backup. So here you go. Here's the box that it came in. So once again, it's the Gemini CDMP 1400, and um, here are a couple of the uh, the features. And of course, go to the website. I'll put it below. Here's the uh, here's the unit itself. I just quickly put it into my current rack, which uh, will be changing very soon. But wired it up and just make sure it works and everything. And I mean, it's a very sleek looking uh, you know uh, unit. It's nice and black. It has the nice uh, I mean nice LED screen there. Um, I mean, it looks great, and like I said, it works um, so far. Works very nicely. Um, you have a mass, uh, you have volume control. You can actually have a mic input go into this thing as well. Um, you even have a pitch uh, control, so you can set the uh, pitch range, and then you can modify that here. So, I mean, as for a backup unit, you cannot ask for for more uh, features on this thing. It's um, quite impressive, actually. 
Here's a quick look at the old uh, the old beast that I've been uh, lugging around for many many years, the uh, Newmark CDN34. So you can see it's huge, weighed a ton, um, and I mean I think the the new Gemini uh, weighs about half uh, the weight. It's only or somewhere around 10 or 15 pounds or so. So I think it's a really a really neat um, solution to a backup and also to a very mini system. So there you go guys, uh, questions, comments below. Don't forget to subscribe and uh, see you on the next one and practice and enjoy.